Today we're taking a quick look at the M5 Stack Dial version 1.1. If you're into Arduino development, this is a really cool ESP32 board. Um, and it comes with a built-in rotary dial, a round LCD screen, a click button, and it's designed to just be inserted into any type of box or module that you might have. So for example, here I got this console from DigiKey and cut a hole into it, which matches up with my dial. So on the back of the dial, it actually can handle a really broad range of voltage on this one, which is nice. So depending on what your project is, uh, you can power it from a range of different batteries and it just simply slots into the hole like this and you can tighten up the ring on the back. This kind of gives you a really cool uh, way that you can build different type of functionality. The rotary encoder's got a really nice tactile click to it, and then you can click on the button right here around M5. The screen also is LCD and it uh, is touchable too. So uh, give me a second and we'll boot it up. Okay, so let's boot this one up. Um, sadly, I don't have the sample software on it anymore. I've been working on this project called Cart, Cent Cart Tender for my golf cart. But it gives you an idea, so what I do is I start the Bluetooth and I start searching uh, for this device, which is the battery management system on the golf cart. If it's able to connect, it will uh, give us the battery power, which it does. And so what I'm working on now is having the ability to specify the maximum charge, and then it will cut off the outlet when it hits that charge. Uh, I live at the top of the hill, and uh, when I go down the hill, the regen um, overcharges the battery and it ends up shutting off. So I'm using this battery tender to monitor uh, the battery charge on the golf cart and then turn off the outlet. But you could build it into almost any project that you would be working on. The dial is really versatile. It's got two ports on the back for different sensors and modules. And uh, I've been loving it. Used it on a few different projects now.